Hi, this is Dr. David Green, founder and CEO of R3 Stem Cell. Today the topic is consistency. And what I'm talking about is amniotic fluid as opposed to uh, bone marrow or adipose. Now, all things being equal, all these treatments work very well for degenerative arthritis and tendinitis and, and other you know, systemic conditions and things like that. But they are not created equal in the sense that amniotic is a very consistent product if, if it comes from a reputable company. Bone marrow, on the other hand, is great when you're young, but as you age physiologically, meaning if you're a three-pack-a-day smoker, if you're obese, if you um, drink a lot, you know, physiologically, you're going you're to be much older than your stated age. Okay, so, but with amniotic, when you look at it, and you, if, for instance, from our manufacturer, they've tested multiple lots, and they've seen that the results from each of those is very consistent between the cell counts, between the growth factors and cytokines. You, know, you end up with a whole orchestra of regenerative elements that are like this, you know, within like 5% of each other between the lots as opposed to the bone marrow that came from, comes from, let's say, a 65-year-old physiologic age individual versus 70 versus 80 versus 30. It's a big, big, big difference. All right, so you have to keep that in mind when you're looking at having a regenerative medicine procedure is consistency versus your uh, physiologic age. Because, you know, it, it's a big deal to undergo this procedure. So you really want to have the best outcome possible. So just keep that in mind. Visit us at r3stemcell.com. There's a lot of educational information on our website. We have over 25 centers of excellence around the country. Call us at 844-GET-STEM. We'd be happy to answer your questions and get you in with one of our centers for treatment. Thank you.